Hello everyone. I know Mother's Day already passed and it's gone. Have anybody ever thought about where the origin of the Mother's Day began? Well, there's two different versions. One is the Watchtower's history. The other is a woman in the 1900s, her history. So I just wanted to show some pictures, and then we will go from there. You know, Mother's Day should be a day that you want to spend time with your mother showing that you care for her by buying her a card, buying her flowers, you know, something to make her alive and knowing that her children, her husband, really cares about her. And that should be something special for any woman out there. Because the reason I'm bringing this up because I was taught that Mother's Day was an evil day and it should not be recognized because every day should be Mother's Day. Well, that was not, not, not the case, me growing up as a Jehovah Witness. Anyway, here's a guy talking about uh, why don't Jehovah Witnesses formally celebrate Mother's Day. So, let's go from there. Well, you see right here, it has to do with religious origins. Paganism. And you go on down, down, down. It talk about um, ancient Greece honor. I don't know how you say that woman's name. The mother of the gods. So I'm not questioning if this story is real or not. I'm not stating that this information is not incorrect. It, not 100% uh, of it, I would say yes. But there's only one little problem. That's only a history that ha could have happened many, many thousands of years ago. What does that got to do with today? What does that got to do with a mother who passed away and her daughter want to remember her mother. That would be something special. She was trying to get it recognized throughout the United States. This is the person you can download her name. She has a pretty interesting history of um, she was trying to get Mother's Day to be recognized in the United States. So people, Watchtower has one little flaw. This lady was a normal lady. She has no history foundation of Greece or any culture since she was living in the United States at that time. They had no internet, no TV, and she 
wanted to do something for everybody would remember their mothers. The watchtower has twisted many things in the past, many doctrines to make their beliefs different. Now, if other religions was not recognizing, and I'm going, what I'm going to say would be 100% truth. If all religions out there wasn't celebrating Mother's Day or Father's Day, I'll bet you Watchtower would be celebrating it. You know why? Because they want to be opposite of different religions, opposite of different religions teaching. That is what they did with the Bible students. When they Bible students rejected Judge Rutherford, Judge Rutherford went in there, eliminate the cross. Bible students was celebrating the cross. Well, there was believing in the cross. Uh, Bible students was celebrating Christmas, holidays, and all that. Judge Rutherford changed all of it to say it was pagan, 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 pagan. Because he didn't want his teaching to be with the Bible students and the world today. So when I learned about Mother's Day, I knew in my conscience there was something was wrong with this teaching. Because I remember hearing the origins of this lady and she dedicated her time to get this up and running and to have something wonderful for parents to recognize and their children recognize their mother because all the hard work she's doing, cleaning house, taking care of the kids, clothe them, send them off to school, a mother's being a mother. And the Watchtower is trying to take that away from one lady wanted people to recognize the goodness of their mother, the love of their mother. So that's the reason why I put this up because Watchtower is taking something good and making it evil when there's no basis on it. This lady had no internet, no nothing to find out that the origin of Mother's Day was a Greek goddess that gave birth to a bunch of gods. No people, she had no knowledge. Does that make her evil? Because she had lack of knowledge of something that she had no clue. You think she would have made Mother's Day knowing the origin of the history of having Mother's Day? No, I don't think she would. So why is the Watchtower taking something of hers from her heart and making it evil? So this is the reason why I wanted to bring this out. The evil here is the watchtower, not of a mother that wanted to have something for her mother because her mother died and she loved her. People, this is not the true religion. Never will be, never going to be. Check the information and see for yourself before you disown your mother on a special day that would make her feel special throughout the whole world on one day to remember your mother or your father. Because a bunch of people don't have time to remember, but by putting it on the calendar and seeing it, it might help you pick up the telephone, call your mother. 
It might help you to get online to send your mother a card or flowers to let her know that you love her because you forgot almost practically almost a whole year you forgot to do something special for your mother. That's the reason why this lady did what she did. So you have to look at the calendar. You have to see Mother's Day and Father's Day. People, Watchtower is evil. Not your mother, not your father, and not the woman who pursue to have something to remind every children the special bond you should have with your mother and your father. So please, people, wake up. Thank you, and have a nice day.